the world is filled with large, powerful animals, and sometimes they need events. Have you ever seen two yaks go head to head? What about a couple of bison fighting for a female? If you want to see some wild clashes like no other, keep watching as we count down 15 epic battles of incredibly powerful wild beasts. Number 15. Grizzly Bear Fighting Bears fight on land and in the water as you can see in this video. There's no choosing where they will fight. When a bear is challenged, it doesn't back down and the fight begins, sometimes lasting a few minutes and others lasting much longer, depending on what is at stake. One of the bears in this video is significantly taller, reaching almost 7 feet and weighs about 800 pounds. Even though the other bear is smaller, the intimidation is evident in his posture. He bars his teeth and holds his ears back. The little bear restricts the larger bear's reach by getting his front legs off the ground. After delivering a devastating blow to the larger bear's face, the larger bear has no choice but to back away. Two male grizzlies engage in a brutal conflict over mating rights. Because the urge to mate is very strong, such fights can lead to serious or fatal injuries. In their mating choices, female grizzlies choose the strongest males to mate with, which means the winner's genes will prevail. Classic evolution in action. Males can reach weights of more than 1,500 pounds, making them the largest terrestrial predators on the planet. However, it is worth noting that polar bears, although slightly larger, are classified as marine mammals. This bear decides to attack another bear and push it into the water, when a third bear intervenes to defend the assaulted bear. It becomes more of a wrestling match with a lot of growling until the bears are exhausted. This caribou takes it to a bear in this next video and charges the bear, pushes it into the water. However, the hunt ends when the bear flips the caribou on its back and ruthlessly kills it. Number 14. Bison Fighting Even if there is traffic, these two bison think it's a good idea to have a fight on the road. They are apathetic. For the sake of the show, tourists get out of their cars to enjoy the spectacle firsthand. One of the gladiators gets fed up and leaves the arena. For the summer's biggest bout, the valley is transformed into a boxing ring. The huge bison is focused solely on one issue. He is the herd stallion and he has no intention of relinquishing his leadership. However, he is having trouble. There's simply too many females. Because he doesn't preside over a harem, he will be forced to contend with numerous enemies because a significant number of them are in heat at the same time. The females don't belong to him. When they're of age, they mate with the first dominant male available. It is believed that this bull bison is that specific bull. He is constantly being challenged despite how he beats most of his opponents easily. He must fight a new battle every day. Staying on top is an expensive affair. During this time, he has sex with various females. By the end of the long day, he is physically exhausted and can barely stay on his feet. His weight has decreased by 90 kilos over the last few weeks, and he's not eaten very much during that time. He managed to achieve his objectives, ensuring his family's future, even though his heart has stopped beating and he dies. When this bison collides head on with another bison and sends the bison flying across the road, that's how powerful these dudes are. Bison bulls vie for the chance to mate with as many as 50 females during mating season. Challenging other bulls and bellowing and wallowing are all forms of dominance in bulls. A bull will hang around a female until she is close to estrus, during which time he will follow her around. Their size and aggression make for exhilarating fights, and the male who is the most powerful claims the prize. Harems are similar to what they would be in real life, with the exception that human males never talk about it. They concoct things and keep them secret, and so one of the bulls wins, the battles will continue. The males will take in the air for a possible mate, but there are a lot of ladies around, so they must deal with the ladies as well as each other. Watch this bison knock its opponent into the adjacent field. Number 13. Snake The mongoose is very agile at killing snakes. Just watch this battle between a king cobra and a mongoose. The mongoose is not faced one second by the cobra's venom but it is somewhat immune to it. When the mongoose decides to charge, it makes minced meat out of the cobra and the snake is obliterated. The mongoose always approaches the cobra with confidence and avoids being bitten. When it sees an opening, it goes for the kill. It tries to bite the head of the cobra just like it's trying to do in this video. In the open field, this mongoose circles another cobra and strikes, but the cobra resists. 
the mongoose comes back for a few rounds and eventually kills the snake. A king cobra fights a python in the small water hole. The python curls up around the cobra as the cobra injects its venom into the constrictor. The two snakes decide they have had enough and part ways, each going in a different direction. Number 12. Elephant Seal Fighting They're looking for a fight and sizes everything to these elephant seals, so the biggest one wins. The males constantly pressure the dominant male to take over his harem. Among males, only 10% can father puppies. The victors triumph through strife. This time, the underdog is the one getting trashed. He had previously showcased his brutality, but now he must kneel in defeat. This is the male seal, and it comes to fight for or claim a piece of the beach. The contest breeds a dominant bull and a handful of lower-ranking beta males. The rookery contains roughly 100 alphas spread over a six-mile area. Seals other than nursing pups spend time fasting while on the rookery. Female hares begin to assemble around dominant males in the middle of December. After birth, they care for their pup for another four weeks. During the fourth week, the mother enters estrus, mates multiple times, and then heads out to sea. The northern elephant seal is a marine mammal with an amazing diving ability and a capacity to go without food for a long time. They gather on the California coast every six months to breed, mate, and shed their skins. After that, they go back to a solitary lifestyle. As if that weren't enough, they're always fighting. Number 11. Bull Elk The levels of testosterone rise in bulls as the rut progresses, and in return, bulls face challengers who are competing for the attention of the females. Some of the fights are small scuffles, while others are more drawn out. Injuries are uncommon in most fights, so they rarely get severe. These bull elks run towards each other and don't hesitate one second to charge into one another, going head to head. One of the elks abandons the fight rather quickly. While the big males slug it out in the clearing, young males fight inside the forest. A hidden camera reveals their strange behavior. Their conflict isn't over mating right now, but over bragging rights. In this case, this watering hole. They don't have horns yet, but they think they do. Next fall, they will fight for real. When these bulls fight, it can be serious. They sometimes fight to the death. For instance, this dead bull you see in this video fought with another bull and the other bull impaled him and killed him on the spot. This deadly turf war between two elks was caught on camera. An older bull is helpless after getting his antlers stuck in a swing set. The young buck repeatedly rams the defenseless bull with his piercing horns. Battles like this are almost impossible to stop. Vacationers honk their horns to stop the fight. Another man yells at the elks. Nothing works. This elk was looking for a fighting partner, and this water buffalo had nothing better to do, so they decided to go at it. They took the fight onto the dirt road, but it wasn't much of a fight. It looked more like they were playing. Number 10. Hippo This hippo is not happy when these wild dogs invade his territory, and lets the wild dogs know it when he shows them his teeth and chases the dogs away. This young impala has already been chased into the river by these dogs. It flailed about, looking for a way out. This hippo, who was annoyed by the disruption, and tried to force the young impala into the water. An adult impala, possibly the mother of the clumsy baby, slowly made her way to the shoreline. The hyenas had their reward before the dogs had a chance to begin their attack. After fighting off the hippo, the dogs focused on the youngster, and one of them bravely swam into the dam to try to get to the impala. As the dogs were outclassed, they had no recourse but to observe in horror as the impala fell to its doom at the dam's bottom. The hippo carried the carcass back over its shoulder. Dogs won't be dining by the lake today. Despite its imposing size, a mere water hole can hold up to 800 hippos, which results in an all-out brawl. Even though the dominant bull is powerful, the outsider challenges. Five tons of hippos fight to determine the strongest and largest beast of them all through biting power and brute strength. One of the bulls admits his loss and walks away. During a drought, a lone hippo is forced to choose between surrendering to the overlord or risking death by fighting. They growl at each other, possibly hurting each other until one of the hippos quits the fight, in which case the dominant male wins his privileges and the females. To survive, the loser moves to a different area of the river, but as a pariah, he becomes a social outcast. Their large teeth are known to deliver a nasty bite when they open their mouths and attempt to chomp their opponents. Their teeth clash and the glamour is audible. One of the hippos surrenders and runs away. 
For some reason, these two appear too lazy to do so, but they seem eager to settle the matter right there on the spot. The buffalo doesn't move anything except its head, and the hippo simply maintains its pretend attack on the buffalo. It almost looks like they're rehearsing for a play. This hippo yawns, while the buffalo lowers its massive head. In slow motion, the hippo's open mouth threat has a clear advantage over the buffalo's passive method. The encounter is heavily in favor of the hippo. This crocodile embarks on an amusement ride free of charge as it comes into hippo territory. The hippos flip and throw the crocodile all over the place, like it was some snack they were prepping on the grill. Apparently, this was just a training session because the crocodile survives. Number 9. Yak A yak and a bull are going at it when a second yak approaches to see what's going on. I'm sure the yak can take care of himself, as you can see it pushed the bull around. This yak goes head to head with the white bull. The battle is even and intense as the two beasts battle it out. Another yak charges in and almost disrupts the fight, but the fight continues until it comes to a sudden stop. In addition to occasionally preying on domestic animals like sheep, goats, horses, and young yaks, snow leopards are opportunistic predators who occasionally catch stragglers left in pastures. In certain locations, snow leopards have been seen to break into a corral and slaughter multiple animals. But don't assume that just because snow leopards like to hunt baby yaks that they are easy prey. This leopard target is hunting a baby yak because the adults are much too big. Even though the leopard holds the offspring by the neck, the mother charges the snow leopard to let go. Despite the difficulty, the snow leopard finally breaks free and flees after a short struggle. Adult snow leopards need to make a kill about every 10 days. He becomes part of the landscape, creeping closer. The yak smells him, but even with their excellent vision, they don't see him. He sets his sight on a youngster that's wandered away. The leopard won't let go. Then the calf's mother rushes in, risking her own life to save her offspring. The cat hangs on, but the mother charges, trying to shake the predator loose. A wingman shows up to boost the defense. It's a remarkable escape, and the snow leopard slings off, frustrated. Number 8. Wolf Having panicked the herd, the wolf looks out for weaker or slower individuals. As the herd splinters and reforms, some of the caribou lose sight of their attacker, giving the wolf the advantage. The wolf needs to grab the caribou by the throw, but one kick by the caribou could end the battle. This time, the wolf has won. The game of survival is finally balanced up here, but a fresh kill won't be kept secret for long. This wolf pack of 15 strong challenges another pack of 9 wolves. Though outnumbered, they set out to meet the other pack and are up for the challenge. The larger pack smells victory, but the smaller pack is fighting over everything it owns. The battle begins in confusion and the smaller pack is confused when the chief of the larger pack takes charge and attacks. The smaller pack is on the run and the best it can do is escape, still alive. The smaller pack is scattered, bound for hard times as they head into exile. These wolves chase coyotes, and if the coyote is caught, it is no match for one wolf, let alone a pack of wolves. Once the coyote is caught, it is eliminated and eaten. These wolves split a herd of elk and manage to isolate an injured elk. The wolves display incredible stamina and perseverance during the hunt and are successful. Number 7. Crab here are a couple of cats playing around with the crab. They're not too sure what it is, so they tap the crab's pincers. The crab is in full battle mode and opens its pincers as it defends itself. A second crab is thrown in the mix as the battle continues. A crab takes on a huge black scorpion in this battle. They lock pincers and push one another before the crab retreats momentarily. The crab flanks the scorpion and tries to escape, but the scorpion chases. A crab and a scorpion are involved in a battle inside an aquarium underwater. The fight looks more like a dance and both creatures don't seem up for it. The crab attacks the scorpion's tail and tries to cut it off, and it does, killing the scorpion afterward. These dogs are chasing a crab, but the crab's pincers are effective to defend itself against the dogs. The dogs are careful, but they manage to flip the crab over when the dog's owner calls off the dogs. Number 6. Elephants Elephant warriors emerge in the bush a short distance from the spectators. Their bloody struggle has been going on for a long time. In this brief pause, you can see the strength of the two bulls, but the fight is not over yet. This elephant casually pretends he's on a stroll in the bush. The rhino doesn't want any trouble. The elephant hits the rhino's rear, almost bowling her over. The rhino swipes back. 
The white rhino weighs in at over 2 tons and has a front horn up to 5 feet long. The horn can be a lethal weapon made of keratin, the same as claws and nails, rock solid and anchored deep into her thick hide. Its large neck hump is pure muscle for lifting its heavy head, giving a powerful upward swing. The elephant keeps coming. The elephant slams into the rhino with the weight equivalent to two SUVs. If the elephant knocks the rhino over, he can kneel on her, crushing ribs and vital organs. The rhino's body shape gives it a lower center of gravity and good balance, making it hard for the elephant to roll her over. The rhino's faster and makes her escape. This rhino and her calf meet up with a trio of elephants, and one of the elephants pushes the rhino out of the way. It doesn't harm the calf, but it's upset at the rhino's presence. The elephant even takes a tree branch to hit the rhino, but the rhino remains calm and stands its ground. In the background, a man hits his truck to scare the elephants away, and it works. This elephant tries to crush a crocodile in the water. The elephant even kneels at one point. When it gets back up, it tries to push the crocodile with its leg. The crocodile grabs onto the elephant's trunk for just a few seconds, but the crocodile is flipped over and seems in bad shape. This crocodile grabs his elephant's trunk. The elephant goes nuts and roars and swings from side to side to get rid of the crocodile, which it does. Number 5. Walrus vs Polar Bear Polar bears announce to walrus herds that it's time to go hunting. Walruses aren't the type to just lie down and let you do whatever you want to them. The bear should exercise extreme caution because the creatures in question are huge and have large fangs that can injure it. Because the bear is smaller, the walruses are not afraid to fight it. A walrus that is injured or sick is a likely target for the polar bear, which means it will be easy to kill. The smaller walruses that he discovers causes him to turn into circles until he lands on his back. Even though walruses are small, they are bulky because of their excessive fat, which protects them from cold and bites. There is no easy way out of this. I am at a loss as to why the other walruses aren't doing their part. If the walruses are going to fight, they should stand back to back, lash out with their tusks and avoid throwing themselves at each other. Unable to hold on to the walrus, the bear eventually drops it. He attempts another attack which also fails. However, he is unable to locate a baby walrus. Looks like our polar bear will have to wait for dinner. It's easy to tell when a polar bear has made a kill. Its fur turns red because of all the victim's blood on it. This polar bear has made a kill and is enjoying this walrus after so much hard work hunting it. Number 4. Musk Ox Fighting Like a buffalo, the musk ox has the general look of a bovine, but it sports the wool of a sheep. Their horns are short and curly, like those of rams. The musk ox looks like he's wearing a viking helmet because of his horns. A bison weighs twice as much of a musk ox, despite a musk ox's heavy head and thick coat. Because the musk ox can gallop at speeds of up to 60 km per hour, you can easily understand how powerful its legs are. Named for the pungent smell of the urine, the musk ox is regarded as one of the strongest beasts to pull a sled. These giants are docile until you anger them, at which point they become like any other creature. They, however, don't try to seek out danger. A few thousand musk oxen inhabit Greenland and Banks Island, and there are roughly 100,000 in the world. Every year, roughly 300 musk oxen are hunted for their meat, which is a prized commodity. Musk oxen are herbivores that subsist on a diet of trees, sedges, forbs, and other vegetation. Musk oxen's main threat comes from polar bears and humans. Number 3. Giraffe This pride of lions chases a giraffe. As one lion tires, another one takes over in this deadly relay. The giraffe leads the lioness into a maze of twisted trees where an attack is nearly impossible. The strategy is not paid off for the hungry pride. The giraffe has the speed and stamina to outrun the pride, but it's being chased into a trap where up ahead, a female waits. It's now up to her, but most lion hunts end in failure, but no lions fail more than those who live in the deserts. These two male giraffes do not like each other, and the younger of the two feels he has a chance of winning and attacks the older male. Usually, a couple of strikes ends a fight, but the stakes are high. The loser will be shut out to exile to live in the desert. The tax exchange when the older male goes for the legs, but the young male is too strong and knocks the older male to the ground. He knows the younger male will give him the final blow, yet he avoids the strike and hits his rival in the stomach and knocks him out. The old male maintains order over the area. This cheetah coalition finds the courage of hunting a huge giraffe and her calf. 
The standoff lasts 20 minutes, but the cars are stalling the hunts. Everyone thinks it's all over, but the cheetahs aren't done yet. One cheetah keeps the father giraffe away, and the other closes in on the mom and the calf. Eventually, the weather gets too hot, and the cheetahs walk away, looking for a place in the shade. Number 2. Rhinoceros This rhino has been attacked from all sides, and the injured rhino has several wounds to demonstrate that. The winning rhino inflicts significant harm when he can flank his opponents. The rhino's skin is tough, but his horns are strong and he can penetrate the skin of another rhino. This rhino's rage at this buffalo, coupled with its lethal horn, compels it to leap on the buffalo, forcing it to the ground. Though another buffalo attempts to help, the rhino is still enraged. Look at that rhino go! What a tenacious beast it is! It is safe to say that the rhino punctured the buffalo's organs, and it is suffering in great pain. Third closes in on their friend as he takes his final breaths. In this video, the rhino is gigantic and uses its might to charge through the Cape Buffalo and knock it down. I'm positive the buffalo believed it was on a roller coaster, and upon exiting, was bruised and sore. Although the rhino is tolerant of hippos, they are still irked by his presence, and they dare him to a shouting match. But the rhino refuses to react and simply stands there to listen to the hippo's shrill voices. As a result, the rhino gets caught up in a struggle with the hippo, which attacks and flips it. Number 1. Lion A single lion is startled when four lions advance on him from behind, hoping to stake out a new territory. The victim is unaware of an attack due to the wind, which causes the attackers to have the advantage. The attack lion who first attempts to flee and then fights tooth and nail to preserve his territory is desperately attempting to hold on to his home. In most cases, the lion-to-lion -lion territorial battles are life and death affairs. Despite wanting to escape, the victim will receive no mercy. A shocking clash between two clandoran males and the Styx Pride subadult female took place at Mala Mala, with a lioness between them. Lionesses that belonged to the Styx Pride also lived in the vicinity, and one of them had a cub that was part of the Clarendon Pride. Incredibly, she emerged from the scrap in one piece. Apparently, neither of these two male lions were her father, so she is still not old enough to breed. So, they want to kill her. Incredible! During this night attack, a pride of lions pressed forward and ganged up on a lone hippo. The hippo used its immense power to get up and crush one of the lionesses. With the pride distracted from the vicious attack, the hippo fled. This time, it headed straight for the water. It was a disaster for the pride. The pride will go hungry again. They haven't yet learned to work together as a single unit. And they also lost a valuable hunter. The lioness is badly injured, and it's doubtful she'll make it through the night. This male lion, accompanied by a younger male, decides to attack this crocodile, but the crocodile resists, and the lion reconsiders. Some of these confrontations were crazy! I like the elephant seals the most. Which one was your favorite? Why don't you let us know in the comments below? Well, that's our countdown of 15 epic battles of incredibly powerful wild beasts. If you enjoyed this video, please give us a like and let us know in the comments what you think. Check out our other videos and subscribe to be part of the fun. Click on the notification icon so you can see our new videos as soon as they're uploaded. That's it for now.